Hey guys, what's up? Um, today I'm gonna try to uh, show you how to record my music and how to record music, you know, um, guitar, bass, drums, vocals. Uh, it's not gonna be a pro video, so um, yeah, hopefully you'll learn something and uh, maybe you'll learn how to record music, hopefully. That's what I'm gonna try to uh, teach you. But uh, yeah, enjoy and um, laugh and uh, I'm gonna start this. So I'm gonna start by showing you my, um, you know, small studio. So uh, yeah, here you have um, my Line 6 Podix tree, which is a sound modulator. You know, it creates um, guitar, bass, amps with uh, like lots of uh, effects. Like you can see, delay, mode, verb. M tone two, you cre can create, you can put like two tones at the times, you know, like a uh, clean guitar with a distortion guitar. Um, here you have my computer, which is a MacBook Pro. Uh, you have some speakers, a screen, and uh, my piano, which is how I do like all the um, weird um, piano and uh, sometimes the drums in my song. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna start by, um, you know, explaining you how this uh, Line 6 product tree works. So it's basically a USB cable that is going. We can see it here, but uh, yeah, it's going in my computer, and this is going in this software, which is Logic Pro 9. Um, I'm gonna show you um, a guitar track. Which is um no 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 take some time take some time take some time I think that's it this one no that's acoustic so here you have an electric guitar sound which comes from the the line six Podix tree I added some reverb and chorus in Logic Pro because there's some effects in the this this uh, sound modulator but sometimes uh, some of the effects in Logic Pro are um, a bit better and uh, easier to work with so um, yeah here's an advice um, don't always take the um, verbs and uh, effects from your uh, recording device uh, sometimes you can take some reverbs and effects in the, the software you use because uh, it's easier to work with um, I hope that makes sense, but uh, yeah, I'm a bit not good to explain things, so um, thanks for uh, listening to this video. Here's the piano. The piano um, is plugged with a MIDI cable. Now it's not plugged, but uh, I usually plug it in my um, M-Audio Fast Track Pro. I'm gonna show it to you uh, later because it's in my room with uh, like the microphone and all that stuff. So yeah, I plug this cable in my sound card and then um, in the computer in the software I mean um, I don't have it here but you can choose like uh, you can with MIDI you can do everything you can um, take this piano and make it sounds like a, a dog a, a cat um, trains and piano uh, everything you want bass drums if you have a piano you can do um, everything you can do guitar bass, drums, a piano, everything you want, you can do it with a, just a simple piano and uh, makes it sound cheaper but uh, worth the price yeah um, yeah so you have piano, guitar, bass and yeah I'm gonna show you in this software you see this is all my tracks you have um, audio nine, which is like guitar, 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 oh, bass, and here you are my vocals, voc, 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 vocals all the way. Okay, as you can see, this ear, I'm gonna try to show you, is the clean electric guitar in my song "All I Want." Okay, here you have the um, another guitar which is uh, in the background. You can hear it 
really loud in the real song, but uh, I'm gonna. All right. Here you have the lead acoustic guitar. Vocals. I close my eyes, then realized you were the one. And then hear back vocals. How do I Full song. This this green track here, I'm gonna stop it, is the drums. I do my drums with a software called Addictive Drums, which is really easy to use. Um, I suggest it to everyone who uh, want a great drum sound. Uh, you can just like, it's really easy to use and uh, create some really cool sounds. So uh, yeah, I downloaded it for free by the way. It costs a lot, but uh, you can get it for free on the internet. So uh, I suggest this software, yeah. And uh, yeah, I think that's it for the software. You know, I uh, think this resumes it. So yeah, drums, comes with guitar. I'm gonna show you the bass. For the bass, I use a lot of um, equalizer, compressor here. Because uh, it makes the sound more, uh, you know, punchy. This here. I also use um, basically lots of effects in the software. I don't really use I don't really use the effect that comes from the uh, Podix tree, but uh, mostly the effects that comes from out from the software. Because uh, it sounds good and. Um, they're easy to use. I think it's the third time I say this in this uh, video, but uh, it's true. So yeah, do this. Use software effects, 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 effects. So I think that's it for um, the instrumental part. You know? Oh yeah, for the drums. See these um, these small things. Well, this is all, um, wait a second, this here is the bass drum, here's the snare, and here's the hi -hat. So I have to, um, you know, place all these um, small um, button, I guess, to create the drum tracks. So check it out. Oh, it's not, it's not the, sorry, it wasn't the hi -hat, it was the tom. So yeah, tom, bass drum snare and uh, yeah I have to uh, create the fills and uh, all that stuff so I, I pretty much create all the drums in my songs and it's it's, uh, it's pretty long so yeah that's the uh, drums and uh, yeah for my pleasure I'm gonna let you hear some of my uh, amazing back vocals no they, they suck Okay, enough, enough. Oh yeah, I'm gonna leave this place right now, cause uh, yeah. So yeah, that's basically um, how I record my music. I know it's not um, really complete, but uh, leave me some comment in the section below. So if you wanna know like um, how I get my guitar sound, how I get my bass sound, or I get my drum sound, and uh, all that stuff, how I get a good sound, because this is basically to show you how to record music, but uh, if you want to know more about, you know, getting a great sound, uh, let me know in the comment section below, and I'm gonna try to um, do a video about it. But uh, for now, oh, I forgot the um, vocal parts. So I'm gonna go in my room, 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 room. Right, it's clean right now. Woo. So yeah, here are my microphone, which is uh, Audio Technica AT2020. Uh, you have a pop filter to, uh, you know, stop the um, the uh, pu 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 pu, cause uh, these are really um, sensible microphones, so uh, you have to have this. So for the mic, my vocals, you have this cable here. It's going here, going up here, in my sound card. What I was uh, talking to you later? Um, no, before. Before, uh, yeah, 
I don't know before. Okay. So here you have the sound card. The microphone goes in the sound card and it goes in my computer. I take when I record vocals, I take my computer and you know, place it on the table and uh just plug this USB cable in the computer and then uh start recording vocals. But one thing you need to know about um sound card and the condenser mic, like this one, this is a condenser mic and this here is a dynamic mic. When you have a condenser mic, you have to um, have a phantom power on your sound card if you want to record with a, a condenser mic. So, um, phantom power is here. I can see it because um, of the focus, but uh, it's supposed to be this small button. If you have it on your sound card, you can record um, with uh, a condenser mic and get a great sound. So, yeah. You have to get a phantom power, and uh, here's the plug for the, um, you know, MIDI cable I was talking to you um, before. You plug the MIDI cable in here, and uh, just plug in the computer, and you can record. Oh shit! Um, your piano and uh, all that stuff. Um, yeah, I think that's it uh, for today. Um, <laughs> this video is ten minutes long, and. Uh, I feel like I haven't explained really anything, so uh, I don't know, but uh, yeah. Let me know if you want to know more and uh, how I get a great sound or something like that. But uh, yeah, and I did this video in one take, which is uh, not good. It's long and uh, boring, so yeah. Uh, by the way, I have a new CD on iTunes, my Christmas CD, you know, with uh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way, you know, and deck the halls with bells of holy, la 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 la. So uh, get it now, it's only uh, four bucks, I think, and uh, it'd be cool. Cool CD for Christmas, and uh, yeah. Love you guys, you guys are awesome, and uh, thank you for watching this video. Hope you learned something, or maybe not. Uh, uh, but yeah, thank you. Bye bye.